real quick welcome back michael carry on fast forward to the end of this video if you want to uh hear a snippet of my new song the title is uh, he said she said or you can just stick around and watch the whole video so um yeah thanks again for watching i'm going to be playing random quarantine clips throughout this whole video so um you guys can get a glimpse of what i've been doing at home um stay safe Good morning, Michael Carry On here. This is the second episode of Carry On TV. The world's kind of crazy right now. I'm stuck at home during this whole virus deal. I hope you guys have all been safe and that your families are safe and that you guys are staying busy. I have been just kind of probably doing the same things you guys are doing. A lot of uh, cleaning. A lot of Netflix and couch chilling. What else have I been doing? I've been doing a ton of hanging out with my dog. It's been a blessing to be able to sit and make music at home. I don't have a studio per se at home, but I was able to put together a little mini, super mini baby studio to just kind of like doodle and get some ideas down. It's basically like my idea area. You guys saw probably, um, I wrote a quarantine song like everybody did. Um, thank you for all the love and the nice things you guys said on that. I just appreciate your time. I know you've got a ton of it, but you know, thank you. In just a few days, uh, I've got a new song that's about to get released into the world. <clears throat> the song is called He Said, She Said, which, uh, <laughs> Which comes out on April 5th. It's been like over seven years since I've released any type of new song, so this is a pretty big deal for me. I historically write all of my songs in first person, but I never really have written a song where it was kind of talking about a he and a she. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's how that came about. I think it's a cool song because it's at a specific time that I think the majority of my audience is in. And uh, that's kind of like basically adulting, the beginning stages of adulthood. You end up getting to those relationships in your, I don't know, mid-twenties to early thirties, where it's like every relationship kind of counts at that point, where like, damn, if I don't marry this person, I've got to go through this all over again. It's kind of about that first relationship where you think, hey, this actually might be forever. Um, sure, you may think about that a lot, but when you're a kid, you've got like, you think you find your soulmate when you're 15 or whatever, but it's like, damn, I have to stand this person for like 15 to 20 more years. And honestly, the odds are against you at that point. Time is against you. And you'd probably be missing out on so much other things in life if you just got locked up that early. So you fast forward to word 30-ish, and you know, you get into a relationship, and um, say you're about a year in, and it's not like, oh, I might just break up with her or whatever, but it's like, yo, we're not getting younger. This is like prime, I am ripe, and uh, we, you know, we've gotta start doing things Sure, you may fight and there may be ups and downs, but at least you know that the, you're able to turn those downs eventually back into ups. You get over each other's differences and it's just like, yeah, that I, cho I choose you. The main th thing of the song says, it'll be okay. All the things that could happen, as long as you can say, you know, we'll be all right, then, then you'll be all right. So, that's a song. I really hope you guys like it. It's going to be out on April 5th, which is in just a few days. And it's actually my birthday. Mew. 
However, Korea is going to get the song slightly ahead of schedule. So um, the world gets to hear it on April 5th. Um, but for all of you guys in Korea listening on Melon, you guys will get the song on the second or the third, I believe. So that's just a, a simple little thank you to you guys over there for always showing me uh, so much love. So Korea, thank you so much. And please enjoy the song before anybody else does. I'm about to be spending my birthday indoors, but that's okay though because you know, there's still plenty to be happy and positive and excited about. The song being one of them. So, yeah, I just wanted to explain to you guys what that song is. So, thank you guys again for, uh, you know, morning cup of coffee with me. I uh, love you, and I'll see you soon. She said that he's the one She said that he was different She said what's done is done And that this was the beginning He's hoping for the best That this was something real But he knows how things can get When there's so much sex appeal just can't keep their hands off each other And if they don't have to Why go searching for another? He said, she said, I think that we'll fall 